Hi everyone, my name is Lisa. Did you enjoy your first lesson? Now it's time for us to review the second lesson. Unit 2 is about how to describe people's appearance by talking about their height, their looks, their hair. <laughs> so before we listen to the dialogue, let's review a few key words and phrases. 자, 먼저, tall, 키가 큰, thin, 마른, curly, 네, 곱슬머리, 란 뜻이죠? 그 다음에 반대말, straight, 생머리, 그리고 look like mama, mama인 것처럼 보인다, 누구처럼 닮았다, 이런 뜻이죠? Let's repeat the words with me. Ready? Tall. Tall. 이번에는 the, 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 thin. Thin. Curly. Curly. Straight. Straight. 오, 발음 어렵죠? 쭈쭈쭈, 쭈쭈쭈, 쭈쭈바. <웃음> 요즘도 쭈쭈바 먹나 다들? Straight. 이렇게 발음하시면 되고요. 그 다음에 뭐뭐처럼 보인다? Look like. 원 포인트 레슨. Look like is used when you ask or describe how someone looks in sentences like What does your brother look like? Or, my sister looks like my mother. She is slim and beautiful. 자, look like는 뭐뭐인 것처럼 보인다, 아니면 누구누구처럼 닮았다 라는 뜻으로 사람의 모습을 묘사할 때 쓰는 표현이에요. 예를 들어, 어, 어, 네 오빠는 어떻게 생겼니? 라고 물어볼 때 What does your brother look like? 라고 말하면 됩니다. 자, 그러면 My sister looks like my mother. She is slim and beautiful. 무슨 뜻일까요? 네, 우리 언니는 엄마를 닮아서 날씬하고 예뻐요. 예뻐! 네, <웃음> 그리고 그냥 간단하게 누구누구처럼 닮았다. 이렇게 좋아하는 연예인하고 비교할 때도 쓸수 있어요. Lisa looks like Cinderella. 이렇게요. 네. All right. This time we're going to listen to a dialogue first. Jason is describing his new classmate Michelle. Michelle 어떻게 생겼는지 한번 들어볼까요? Mom, guess what? There's a new girl in my class. Her name is Michelle. Really? What does she look like? Is she pretty? Yes, she's tall and thin. She also has a pretty smile. I see. What about her hairstyle? Does she have nice curly hair like me? No, she has long straight hair. I think she's really pretty. Now, you tell me, what does Michelle look like? All right, let's check together. 오늘의 key expression 하고 key words 같이 이용해서 쓰면 되겠죠? Michelle is tall and thin. She has a pretty smile. She has long straight hair. Michelle 어떻게 생겼죠? Michelle은 어, 키가 크고 말랐다. 예쁜 미소를 가지고 있고 또 머리는 네, 긴 생머리. All right. 긴 생머리 아닌데요. 네. All right, you guys. You did a good job and we'll see you in the next lesson. Bye.